then it's only a like you're controlling yourself like you're 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 letting an external thing control you by putting a blocker or something like that on there and i think that like for example you should be able to control it yourself if you are deciding to go on tiktok that's your fault it's not a blocker's fault it's not the website's fault it's not xqc's fault it's not the girl's fault it's your fault and the moment that you take accountability for that is the moment that it changes because i guarantee you people that put blockers up for these websites eventually just take them off because it, I, in my like and also this is for me this is for this is what i think so like if this works for you then do it but for me i think that the only time that you can really overcome it is whenever you don't have to that's whenever you know that you're on top of it extremely stimulating content that forces you out of doing the things that you love it's up to you to replace these habits and work harder to live a more fulfilling mm -hmm. life it may seem difficult at first but it's definitely possible consistency and small changes are the most important elements yeah. in this <clears throat> uh so yeah Make sure to stay safe out there. I think some people are just disappointed with the way that games are nowadays because they're, you know, like games have microtransactions and shit like that. I d I'm like such a, I'm like a massive optimist for video games. I really am. I'm such a positive optimist for games. I love games. I love playing games. I love, you know, uh, looking at new games, everything like that. It's, it's great. You know, and I like it a lot more, by the way. I like it way more off stream than doing it on stream, which sounds kind of weird. There are some things that I like doing on stream. Some games I like on stream, some games off stream. But like whenever I want to get into a game, I love to be able to do that off stream. I love to be able to just sit down and play a game and just immerse myself in it and enjoy myself. Has Dragon's Dogma help you uh, love games? Yeah, absolutely. I had a lot of fun with that. You don't feel like doing anything else with your life? Um, this is just going to get into a Doomer rant. Like, I don't want to get into that. I'll link you guys a video. It's a good video, man. Like, uh, somebody just decided to link this to me randomly. I think this is a good video. Level up your gaming space with metal posters from Displate. Hang your displates in seconds. Swap them whenever you like. Get official art from your favorite games on a uniquely designed metal canvas and choose from thousands of posters. Join over 3 million collectors now. Your wall upgrade is here. Shop now at Displate.com. You know what, Espen, why don't you do it? I can't bear this. Oh, what? Okay, hold on. What do I say? Oh, no. I'm, <laughs> oh, I'm so nervous. I love bananas. Donkey Kong is here. <laughs> oh, I love bananas. Donkey Kong is here. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. It's pretty good, pretty yeah. Good. So it's basically a tech talk. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bananas are badass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> love them things. Uh, oh, shit, that reminds me of another thing. Uh, Emily taped herself to a wall yesterday. Did you see That's that? That's crazy. I saw that she did that. I would never do that. 
I would. Fuck that, man. Dude, I'm thinking about taking it and plus wanting it. Yeah? I'm thinking about just doing it in public. You should take a wall down. to yourself. Dude. <laughs> I'm thinking about doing yeah. it on 6th Street. Really? Yeah, why not? That sounds like a bad time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That sounds People overwhelmingly People unspeakable yes. things to you. They're, yeah, they're okay. as long as it's clipped, it's fine. As long as they don't stab you, it should be pretty much okay, right? As long as I don't die from the stabbing, yeah. it's okay. Yeah, that's really what matters. Then I'll get Zenkai boosted, and then I'll come back stronger, like Goku. Wait, Zenkai boosted? Yeah. Is that whenever you eat a senzu bean and you come back ten times stronger? Oh, uh, so Zenkai boosts whenever you take damage and you don't die from it. When you heal, you're stronger. Oh, I thought it was yeah. just with senzu beans. I didn't know. No, nah, it can be whatever. Oh. Am I the only person that pretty much stopped really watching Dragon Ball Z after the Frieza saga? Y- you know what? That is a super common thing. You know why? It's because they kept playing the fucking rerun before he kills them. Yep. They did that for three weeks. I said, I'm done. Yep. I I know a ton of people that they stopped watching Dragon Ball Z after the Frieza saga because not only that, there was a big, there was a a really long time between the Frieza saga to to the Cell saga starting. Mm -hmm. There was also like a, like a gap where um, Cooler shows up and the androids show up. Brawly, I Uh, think too. Is that Brawly? Is Brawly? Or is no, Brawly's Brawly? the movies. The Brawly so movie, long ago. I think it's set around the same time. Uh huh. But uh, yeah, there's the Brawly movie, and then the uh, right. Brawly, was set the Brawly movie and the Cooler movie. Uh, King Cold comes with Mecha Frieza. Yeah. Uh, and then after that, Future Trunks comes. The androids come. Yeah. They do the whole android arc, and then it's the Cell That's saga. It's like a whole weird thing. The androids yeah. were before Cell. Yeah, yeah, because the the Cell had to suck Android 18 and 17 into his yes, tentacle. Yes, yes. Yeah, oh, and then yes. Vegeta takes. Seventeens uh, or uh, what, what, uh, the, the the stupid clown android goes and rips his arms off, nice. and he goes like nuts. Oh, bro, Vegeta's so sick. And that's also when Vegeta didn't care anymore. He didn't care about being stronger than Kakarot. Yeah, and then something inside of him snapped. Man, I, maybe I should have kept watching it. That, that was, was like, kind of cool. I, I feel was. like the uh, like Dragon Ball Z was like the gateway to like watching anime for so many people. Like, yes, yeah, I know at least it was. For yeah, me. it was accessible. Yeah, Dragon yeah. Ball Z and Avatar: The Last Airbender. Dude, I'm I for anime? Yeah, 100%. Oh, dang. It was the most anime-like American cartoon. Mm-hmm. I just, I, wa- I looked at that shit. I thought it was stupid. Avatar? Yeah, yeah I, I didn't I watch Avatar it either. Stupid. It's really good. Oh, my God, it's amazing. It's I've heard it's, it's I've heard really it's outstanding. I just, I I just never watched it. I also, bro, I've watched it on stream, the whole thing. Yeah. Y'all could do it, too. You ever do a subathon? Just watch the whole thing. Holy shit. Really? Yeah. It's I good. <laughs> okay. so I, I, saw a, I saw a video about an anime, and uh, it's called My Life as Some Girl's Dog. And it's about how this girl, this guy gets reincarnated as a dog. And then oh. it's worse. So, oh. um, so <laughs> is this an anime or a Tumblr page? It, it's yeah. uh-huh. it's, Devi- it's going to go to DeviantArt. <laughs> and so anyway, uh, the girl progressively gets a more and more sexual relationship with this dog what? and it's like so it's a 12 episode right, be- is this an, a new show yeah. i haven't heard of this yeah. there's so many shows like that though the like reincarnation bullshit. Oh, they're, they're just getting weirder and weirder because it's been done so many times yeah like so i'm reincarnated <laughs> as a spider yeah that one wasn't that bad was it It was cute wait what what happens with the dog do they so in the first episode she takes a shower or sorry a bath with the dog naked nice and then it escalates from there and so, like, you've got all the, you know, the... Dog naked? Yeah, yeah, you could say that. I think so. But it's like a person, and it's like all this crazy, weird stuff. And it did make me wonder if maybe it's going too far. Well, I, I don't mean, know. What do you guys think? I mean, that sounds like the exact premise of the B movie, only it's a dog. I never watched the B movie because I'm the not The B movie is weird. I'm going to say it. Yeah, it's weird. I haven't, I haven't seen the B movie. What the, how the fuck do you guys know what the B movie is? Isn't that fucking The, the B I, movie I feel, was, like, like that was, that was like the the most popular like, animated show like 10 years ago, right? The, the B movie, yeah, it was incredibly popular. I, I, I read the entire script yeah, So, before. like, the, the plot is uh, the it's main character is a B, right? And <laughs> I don't remember what happens. Like, some, some chick's husband is, like, his arch nemesis, and then he literally cucks the husband. Yep. The human wife falls in love with the B, and they, like, get married or something. Yep. Uh, oh, pollination. It's a, it's a metaphor. Wait, mm-hmm. what the fuck? Really? Yep. Yeah. Yes, that's and real. It's and they're movie. selling that to kids? Yes. Yep. But it, it, I think it was a good movie. I think I remember. I it was hilarious. It. <laughs> it was probably good. Oh my yeah. god! <laughs> it has Jerry Seinfeld's voice as the B, and that dude's voice is hilarious to me. My favorite movie. What's the deal with that? Mega Mind is so fucking good. Oh, Mega Mind is amazing. Mega I Mind never pl- seen that. that one. Is so oh my good. god! What do you watch, bro? Uh, well, I mean, I'm not gonna. Maybe I'll start watching this dog thing. 
<laughs> I mean, I kind of want to see it. I, I do. It's like, it, wh- how bad can it get? Well, let's find out. Yeah, like, how, how messed up is the person that actually made this? Yeah, yeah. It's like, I always want to, like, anytime, like, I've been on the internet 20 years, so I know pretty much everything that's wrong with people. Yeah. And anytime that I start seeing it, I will always, like, look into it because it's like going to a zoo. Mm. And, like, you get to look at these people and the kind of stuff. Well, literally, a lot of times, in this case, it is like going to a zoo. And, and like, you'll get to see the kind of stuff that they're into and, and everything yeah. like that. And it's, yes. like, so, it's so crazy because, like, people have evolved to a point now where they can be sexually attracted exclusively to animals that aren't real. So so we're on the subject now. W- yeah. Would you say that most times uh, bestiality is bad, right? Or Well, pretty what? much, yeah. I think it depends. What is happening? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So, like, oh, so what wait is happening? Wait, uh, uh, wait a second. So I yeah, asked... Was good. In the video. Yeah. I, I There's asked, no wait a second. I asked all of them, <laughs> and I said, what is your tolerance level for controversy and edginess? Yeah. Okay, but and I thought what you did meant, like, politics. That's stuff. what you thought. Okay, hold on, hold on. That's I want to explore that. Thought. Is bestiality is not controversy. It's not that big of a deal. I don't think there's anybody who's remotely okay, sane well, that you... thinks it's okay. Well, hear me out. So... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Like I said, anybody who's remotely <laughs> saying Okay, so yeah. what so what if it's like a centaur girl, like in an anime, and then you don't interact with the back half, just the top half. I'm not, I'm not, I, I you know feel I mean? like so that's the kind of stuff that's the interesting yeah. stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. You know? That's the kind of stuff that turns people into furries. Yeah, like there's okay, this one there's this one chick called girls Centauri. Girls are not furries. Are no, yeah, they are. They're not. They are. No, they are not. Yeah, they are. What they're more human than animal. Well, I'm only interacting with the human half furries of the centaur. Furries are anthropomorphic animals. So here's the thing. That leans into technically what Tectone is saying. What is it? What no, is that, yeah, what you're, hey, this? welcome. Because if you're saying more, like if it's like 90%, I mean, in his case, it's 50%. Yeah, 50%. Or maybe what, 49? Probably like 41. Yeah, probably, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, but how does like thinking a, a girl wearing cat ears looks nice mean you want to, mean you, you're in the bestiality? Well, I mean, well, it's, it depends on what part's cat. So here's yeah. the truth. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. There's obviously a spectrum. Yeah, there is. And there's there are the two acceptable <laughs> things, and then everything after that is being a fucking furry. Yeah. Cat ears and a tail, that's fine. Yeah. Anything after that, that is on another website. So 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 you think you would say like a plus or minus five percent? Maybe ten percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plus or minus five. You know, yeah, you know. yeah. I mean, like five, five to ten percent. Nothing okay. crazy. Like maybe a little bit different type of eyes. Maybe like different facial structure a bit. You know, but nothing, nothing too crazy. Okay. I, I don't okay. think that's like a super furry thing. Well, yeah, it's just like a normal. You know, just because because you have again, like <laughs> if if you think that's weird, you are so lucky. Mm. If you think that's weird, cool. So. Yeah, it, and it's like I. <laughs> I just don't get why cat girls get hate because like the Playboy Bunny. Yes, they do. No, they don't. No, they don't. No, they yes, don't. they do. Oh, by who? Oh no, by no, like, no cat do. girls have it so easy, man. They do. All yeah. the cat girls I know just yeah. waltz through life. <laughs> I'm just. I've seen people say that's furry shit, and it just makes me angry. The people my that are saying that's furry shit are 43. True. Okay. Like they play classic WoW. They're not. They're yeah. not typing it. They're. Uh, they're talking to Siri and they're telling. Us <laughs> yeah. Could you tell him? Tell him. They're the ones that are like. They'll type out like a whole well-written paragraph in like a Twitch chat of thirty-five thousand people and go. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Honestly, whenever I see those, I feel kind of sad. Yeah, it's, like, gonna, it's like they that's wanted it. to share their thoughts. They weren't just trying to like you know be a part of the emote wall spam. I will yeah. scroll up and I will yep. sometimes read the paragraph. I do, I do that every I time. Will, I will go through and I'll read it and I'll be like, thank God that we took our time out to read your stupid fucking opinion <laughs> about this. And like every once in a while, it's something that's like really good. It's like, hey man, I've been watching you for a long time. Really like the stream. I watch it with my dog, and you know, it's like a good time and all that. Like I, you know, I lost my cat and so now i'm watching you it's like oh that's so nice right but most of the time it's like bro i think that you're such a fucking fake bitch you're You're balding you're ugly you're getting fat nobody likes you i fucking hate you bitch it just goes on and on and on the uh have you ever stopped to read one of those things and you're like you know what? This guy's yeah. This guy's right. I'm I'm wrong about what I'm talking about. Speaking, no, I never. No, it's never happened. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So there's been a very popular um, post on 4chan going around. I don't know if any of you all have seen it. And they've the connected hacker? myself. Uh, yeah, no, yeah, the hacker. Um, it's his website. And so they've connected myself and Mr. Beast to a talent agency that we're a part of, which is called Night, Night okay. Media. Right. And basically, they've just gone backwards. And now, according to a lot of these people, um, we work directly for Disney. <laughs> what? Like, we are, we are doing their work. This is, we are part of the new Illuminati. And I think this is a compliment. Because it's like, if, if I'm that important, that this is news to me. I think this is, is awesome. Is that on poll or B? Both. Oh my god! I, I don't oh, know. It's, it's everywhere. That. Like it's it, not ironic. <laughs> I mean, I'm just asking. It's hard to okay. tell sometimes. It's hard to tell sometimes. I'm just I'm asking. Like, I feel like a lot of times people do that as a joke. No, yeah. I, I think like I, don't, so, I think yeah, it doesn't. It does. Either it starts as a joke and then people take it seriously, or people take it seriously and then people meme it. So what it is is like, haha, that's really funny. But I mean, like, really, it is kind of a coincidence, huh? <laughs> you know, yeah. and, and that's how it is uh, no I, I these are the kinds of people where like some guy i remember one time uh there's a fucking comment on my youtube channel some guy said man this asman guy he is based and then a reply to the comment that got more likes than no the original way. comment said ratio how the fuck can you say he's based he hasn't even called the jews out once oh my god no way yeah. what was the video it was probably about like it was just it not was related at all. West. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, I think it was about like uh, Genshin Impact or something. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. gotta be it. Holy literally shit. nothing to do with it. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the way these people go. And and like yeah, I'll read these uh, these fan <laughs> fictions people write about me, and then like obviously some of these people they'll read this and they'll be like, holy fuck, this guy. Like Asmon and Asmodeus, which is like some demon. This is this is exactly what fucking Alex Jones has been warning us about. This guy is in the Bible at the end of the fucking book. It's just the worst person, and and like they, they're like they're putting it right in front of us, and we can't. They think we can't see it. We can see it, yeah. and then they'll come into my chat and they'll start you know trying to take me to task. They're gonna say, you know what? There it is. See, it's not a fucking joke. Asmodeus, yeah, a prince of demons in hell. Uh -huh. We call him Asmod for short. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's you. That that's me. That's is that what Asmodan's based off of in Diablo? Asmodan? Uh, probably yes. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Uh, I'm I'm not really sure. I'd have to really think about it. Uh, Asmodan was a strategist. Act three, maybe that was it. I don't really know the lore of Asmodeus or anything. I just know people compare me to him because I have the same name, and so well, your name is Asmond Gold. Oh fuck God! I actually have it to where if you type Asmond. You get fucking timed out. <laughs> I, I'm so sick of this shit. Like, I've been getting called Asmond since I was fucking 16. How? Asmond. I don't know. Like, my guild master. Like, and he was the guild master, so I couldn't really tell him otherwise. <laughs> so I just had to fucking deal. And then everybody's, yeah, it's Asmond. It's like, okay, great. I, I don't, like, people just do that sometimes. Like, I, yeah. I always have Estefan. Estefan, yeah. yeah. People are like Estefan or Estefond. Yeah. That's another one. I think my dad did that at the beginning because really? he didn't understand what it was. I yeah, don't, I don't know what I don't know where it comes from, but it just yeah. people just throw a random letter in there. Oh, here's what I don't get, and I was hoping you could help me out with this. Uh, people who use big words all the time, like what? Like for example, uh, okay, this might not be a big word, like wheelbarrow. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck yeah. is up with that shit? <laughs> no, like there's these people who use these big ass words that I never understand. And it's it's like when I watch Hassan stream, yeah, and he says all this shit. Like, I don't know. Like, like socialism. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Wait, no, but actually. Yeah. <laughs> but what the fuck? Okay, this is going to sound crazy. I don't know what a Democrat is or yeah. a Republican or or even to quote a great man. Um, Y'all know Sear? So Sear comments this underneath my Twitter post, and I say, I'm going to an anime con. And he says in all caps, and breathe the same air as those libs? No thanks, I'll stay in Texas where the real men are. I said what I said. Kelly is commie and full of clowns, and JFK Jr. is still alive. Wake up, this country makes me vomit, since Sleepy Joe and libs are running USA for money. Two weeks, and the Patriots are going to have everything back to normal, guys. Just two more weeks. I mean, I uh, you would, all go, don't know that that f reference. Yeah, I don't get that. Yeah, I'm yeah, trust me. Like that's a, that's an even deeper level of 
the same thing. Okay. Well, I, I would call you based, but you know. Yeah. You didn't even. Yeah, I didn't even bring him up. <laughs> <laughs> so, so what's a libtard? Uh, well, it's a liberal. And what's a liberal? A libtard. It's a libtard. <laughs> okay. It's, it's a left-leaning person. They're, they're, so, yeah. You know, uh, like, what left and right is, right? No. So, like, basically, uh, let's I don't, I don't touch like the the political so, structure. Uh, thing. It it depends because like now, everybody just has like an identification, and it's like you can say, oh, liberals think this, and then they're gonna be people like, no, they don't, they don't think that, they don't think everybody should be treated equal, uh, uh-uh. uh, and then other people say the same shit about conservatives. So basically, um, the side that you're not is the side of the people that have all the bad opinions. Okay. And the side that you're part of is the side of the people that have all the good opinions. Okay. And if you that's a pretty reasonable way yeah, of thinking. If you if you yeah, complicate it sense. if you complicate it more than that, you're going to uh, run into problems. Okay. I, I I'm like twenty nine. I've you're gonna I've, confuse people. I've never used labels for nothing. Yeah. Like, I don't I don't spe- specify with any Have you ever voted before? No. There's no way you've never, never voted? voted in anything. I haven't voted either. No, really? am, I allo- am, am I allowed to say that? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I've never voted. It's not illegal. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm like I'm good. I'd rather just play video games. Yeah. Did you get scared? <laughs> yes, I, I did. <laughs> well, like well, in some countries, I've never voted it is. For anything. Not yeah. even class president. Wait, wait, it's illegal to uh, not vote in some countries? Yes, that's right. Wait, you where? are you are compelled. Um, Australia, I think that it's illegal, huh, and I think there's a couple of those European countries of people think they're better than us. I, I think I'll go out to vote when Dwayne gets elected for president. Yeah. Obviously, no, Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Oh, yeah, yeah, and then also Mr. Beast. I'll vote for those two. Okay, yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, yeah. I, I would vote for Mr. Beast. Same. You don't vote for the Rock. Fuck it, yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> That'd sick. be funny. Like, imagine we had The Rock as a president. That'd be, so That'd cool. be like a movie, but it's like real life. Yeah, so. <laughs> never have an actor as a president, though. Yeah, imagine that. That would be, oh, man. Imagine that. It's actually happened multiple times now. Dude, I, speaking of which, I so I yeah. never watched the Back to the Future movies like, uh-huh. from start to finish. Same. I'd watch them on TV. They'd be on, like, yeah. TBS or TNT or something as, as a kid, and I'd watch part of it. But I, I watched all three of them back to back. First off, absolutely incredible, phenomenal movies. Yeah. But they they made that joke about Reagan. He's like he's like who's president? He's like Reagan. He's like Reagan's an actor. He, he wouldn't be president. And it yeah. just, it was so funny how it was like history repeats itself. Yeah. Time and just the whole warping of I don't know. I thought it was. Great. Oh, I think it's amazing. I I I love how now it's like basically I was talking to you about this earlier, like before the stream. It's like on Twitch. How can you tell what's going to be entertaining? Think of the stupidest thing possible. Uh-huh. That's what's entertaining. It's literally that simple. Like, there was a time that S-Fan did a stream. It was Schlatt's stream, and the entire stream was focused around dodgeball. And all S-Fan did was sit there and stare at the camera. That was it. He did nothing 